hello friends in this video i will show you how to add a text input layout to a dialog box in sketchware so here i have this button on clicking which it displays a dialog box with a edit text in text input layout here i can add any name which will appear in the list view below this add button so if i write apple it will get added and then i can add more things like this so i will show you how to do this in sketchware in sketchware first we have to switch on app compact and design this is required for adding text input layout then i have added this button one and a list view this list view is a custom list view custom view is list item one and this list item one contains text view one now back to main.xml here when button 1 is clicked here I have added a dialog component called dialog underscore add so when button 1 is clicked I set the title as add fruit then I create a new edit text programmatically so here I write final edit text edit text 1 equal to new edit text main activity dot this if you are in some other activity you have to change it here otherwise you have to use this main activity dot this if you are on main activity then you have to set the layout params for this edit text one i have set its layout params as new linear layout dot layout params linear layout dot layout params dot match parent this will be the width and linear layout dot layout params dot wrap content this will be the height of edit text then i have set the hint as fruit name so this is about the edit text here i have created a new edit text programmatically after this i have created a new text input layout so for creating a new text input layout i have written android or support dot design dot widget dot text input layout then i have given it a name text input one equal to new text input layout main activity dot this the same as this after this i have set the layout params for this text input layout i have set the layout params for text input one as width match parent and height wrap content after that i have added edit text one to text input one by writing text input one dot add view edit text one next i have set the view of this dialog underscore add as text input one by writing dialog underscore add dot set view text input one so this dialog underscore add is same as the dialog underscore add here after this i have added a string variable name this is a string variable then i have set the ok button as add and i have defined this string variable name as equal to edit text one dot get text dot two string so edit text one is same as this edit text one so this string variable name is equal to edit text one dot get text dot two string after that i have added it to the list map map list using this key item and then I have displayed this list map in list view 1. Then I have set the cancel button for dialog and I have used dialog show block. And once, once I have used the set list custom view data, the next event will be on bind custom view. So here I have used text view 1 set text get value at position key item of list map map list so this will be here i have used the same key as in this map list so this will create an app which looks like this where we can add items using an edit text in text input layout in dialog box so here i can add more items if you have to save this list in for next time then we can save it in 
file shared preferences by converting it to JSON. Now that's all in this video. Thank you very much for watching this.